Hi, this is Teacher Sam. Welcome to Practical Research. Today, we are going to learn about the strengths and weaknesses of quantitative research. Are you ready? Let's go! Let us start this lesson with this fact. Every person has strengths and weaknesses that made them unique and different from other people. Do you agree with me? Yes, it's true. Not only the people have strengths and weaknesses, but Things and animals also. But why is it important to identify the strengths and weaknesses of a person or a thing? It's important to know the strengths and weaknesses of a person or a thing in order to know the adjustments we should make when we encounter them. Quantitative research has also strengths and weaknesses, and that is what we are going to discuss today. These are the following strengths of quantitative research. The first one is, it can't be easily misinterpreted. The second one, it can cater huge amount of data. The numerical data can be analyzed in a quick and easy way. And the last one, it can be replicated. Quantitative research cannot be easily misinterpreted because it provides numerical data. And it can cater a huge amount of data because it uses statistical techniques in analyzing the gathered data. Also, the numerical data in quantitative research can be analyzed in a quick and easy way because it employs statistical tools in data analysis. And the last one, quantitative studies are replicable. Standardized approaches allow the study to be replicated in different areas or over time with the formulation of comparable findings. Now that we are done talking about the strengths of quantitative research, let us now move on to the weaknesses of quantitative research. The following are the weaknesses of quantitative research. It requires large number of respondents. It is costly. Context explaining the results are usually ignored. There are many informations that are difficult to gather. And the last one, data may be incomplete or inaccurate. Quantitative research is time-consuming and tiring because you'll need many research participants to conduct the study. And aside from that, quantitative research is costly because you'll be having large number of participants. In quantitative research also, the context explaining the results of the study are usually ignored because people tend to look on numerical data 
and graphical illustrations. Aside from that, there are many information that are difficult to gather in quantitative research. Using structured research instruments, sensitive issues like premarital sex, early pregnancy, domestic violence, and etc. are difficult to gather. And the last one is, if not done seriously and correctly, data from the questionnaires may be incomplete and inaccurate. So, those are the strengths and weaknesses of quantitative research. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you had learned something from me today. Goodbye!